It's Tuesday. to explain that I'm just going to be doing talking in this video because it's the only thing that I can do while eating this bowl of fruit. Um, I'm being punished. I'm being punished for not finishing another punishment. Kind of fun that I've been punished twice. The story is that I forgot my fossum fact and Amy caught me. And she punished me by limiting the next three episodes of my videos. But I didn't do that. I got through two, I think. But I really wanted to do that t-shirt challenge. This is actually really good, Amy. For breaking that punishment, she punished me to eat three tins of fruit. Now, she told me I had to do peaches, apricots, and lychees, which is some berry type fruit, but they don't sell in the states. So I got peaches and pears and apricots. But I don't think I'm going to get to the apricots because this bowl was one and a half cans. And I don't think I can eat that much in one sitting. But Amy, if this isn't enough fruit, I can just do the rest of it next time. Um, also, this is a challenge from Chris that she issued yesterday. I don't usually dress up like Harry Potter. I figured that I should also talk about how awesome Danny and Leah are. I've known Danny for over a year now, and she's like this amazing artist, and she's ridiculously fun, and she fights robots. <laughs> yeah, you and Leah is really cool too. I've watched her videos for a while, since sometime after Prophecy. And um, we were actually both at Prophecy, but we didn't know each other. And hopefully I'll meet her at some point this summer. My awesome fact for today, even though it's not really new, is that there will be Wizard Rock at the ball at the Symposium Portis this summer in Dallas, Texas. And that's exciting for me because I've been to two of these Symposium balls before. I mean, the only really way, and the only way you can really get Wizard Rock at those is to request 99 Red Balloons and then to sing 99 Death Eaters lyrics over that at the top of your lungs. Because for some reason, before Portis, the organizers of these symposiums wouldn't let anyone play Wizard Rock for some reason, citing the excuse that not everybody likes it. Well, not everybody likes Justin Timberlake, so I don't understand why they wouldn't let him play, like, losing your tie. I mean, seriously. Go Portis. But Ministry of Magic is probably like the best choice you could have for a band during a ball for the dance music. I'm really looking forward to it. It's going to be amazing. As a rock band, it's going to be the coolest ball at a symposium ever. I still have half a bowl of fruit left. I'm actually getting really full. <laughs> never be forced to eat something in such an amount when it's actually good, because then you don't like it anymore. This is my last bite. I hope that was enough, because I really don't want to have to do this again. The bowl is empty, and that was the peaches, and that's the pears. There's like two pear halves left. So I ate 
Oh, one and a half cans. You probably can't see it, but it says that a serving size is a half a cup. And I just had seven servings of canned fruit. I'm very full. <laughs>